campus. This is a terrific visit here by pitching coach Lilliquist. And basically what you're seeing is, hey, calm down here, big boy. And then Matt Weider said, give me your best two pitches. And right now they're saying, give me your best two pitches. It should be no sign. It'll be sink or change up or change of change up. But when we just get back behind the plane, I want to, I don't want to see any sign. You should already be on the same page, just like coming out of a football huddle. You know the play that is called. Let's go. Hayward, Almora, and now uh, Contreras support the latter of two via hit batsman plays. And now we're going to have a pinch runner at first as Ian Happ will come out to represent the tying run. Well, that leaves only Victor Caratini available on the Cubs bench at this point, but Joe Madden's going to do everything he can to tie the game or more here with two out in the last of the night. David Bodie, the pinch hitter, he's been very good off the bench, three for six in this capacity. Behind 0-1. We talked about Bodie last time we saw the Cubs. This is his fifth stint with the Major League team. Up and down all year, seemingly, from AAA. David Bodie, one of those hitters that has hit the ball hard, especially the last two weeks. Best in baseball and hard hit average. And the Cubs are down to their final strike tonight. Oh, wow. Alan Porter with a very generous call in the bottom of the zone, but he got it right. The difference between 1-2 and 2-1 is about 200 points on the batting average. Madsen's 1-2 pitch, and it's a 2-2 count now. We've seen Matson get ahead. We just haven't seen his ability to put away. And that's something that he has done well in this closer role. See Justin Miller up in the, the pen for the Nationals. But even though Matson has, has done a good job getting ahead of these Cubs hitters, he needs that strike three pitch or that put away pitch to get that third out. They're clearing space beyond the outfield fence on Sheffield for a David Bodie statue <laughs> here at Wrigleyville. And a Hollywood ending for David Bodie, a 25-year-old who's been sitting idle in the bench for 25 years. 
for, for eight innings, gets a fastball down in the zone. Perfect swing down, a magical swing, a magnificent result with the bat flip. That's one that Mr. Bodie will never, ever forget. Oh, man, alive. Pinch hit, walk off, grand slam. In all a result of baseball gods do not lie. Wilmer Defoe on the miscue allows this inning to continue. A misplayed ball, two hit batsmen, and Max Scherzer's brilliant night is wiped away completely. My goodness. And Matt just for the Cubs, this is one night they can look back in the middle of October and say, hey, this has the feel of 2016. This has a magical feel as well. Wow. David Bodie. What a moment. A fantastic finish at Wrigley. And a 4-3 stirring Cubs come from behind win. Coming up next at Sports Center tomorrow, exclusive coverage of the Mets and Yankees at 7 Eastern. For Alex Rodriguez and Jessica Mendoza, Matt Vasgersian saying good night from Wrigley Field. Sports Center is next with John Bucigras and John Anderson.